Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Dear students, today we are going to study chapter 2, uh, Organization of Organisms. This can also be written as Cell Structure and Organization. And in this chapter, inshallah, we will study about the cell, structure of the cell, cell organelles, then uh, maybe differences between animal and plant cells, similarities between both of these, then sizes of the specimen and some of the special cells. Uh, so let's start. Uh, what is cell? Cell is the basic structural and functional unit of life. It means all the living organisms are made up of cells and all the cells are produced from the pre-existing cells. Now let's study about the structure of a cell. Cell uh, contains the following organelles that is cell membrane, cytoplasm, nucleus, mitochondria, ribosomes, cell wall, vacuole and chloroplast. So uh, where is cell membrane found? This is around the cell cytoplasm and this is partially permeable membrane a layer that forms a boundary of the uh, around of the cytoplasm and uh, it is found around the cytoplasm and what is the function it prevents cell contents from escaping and it controls what substances enter and leave the cell so this is the boundary of a cell this is present in both animal and plant cells next is the uh, largest organelle which is the cell cytoplasm it is between the cell membrane and the nuclear membrane uh, around uh, outside the nucleus and inside the uh, cell membrane all the material is the cytoplasm it is a jelly like uh, with particles and organelles in it. Uh, it is found enclosed by the cell membrane and it contains the cell organelles, for example, mitochondria and nucleus, uh, site of the chemical reactions, etc. Then is a nucleus, which is a circular or oval structure containing DNA in the form of chromosomes. It is located inside the cytoplasm and it controls cell division, uh, controls cell development and controls the cell activities because this is the control center. Next are mitochondria. If it is singular called as mitochondrion and if it is plural called as mitochondria. It is circular oval or slipper shaped organelles inside the cytoplasm and is responsible for aerobic respiration. Next are the ribosomes, which are small circular structures attached to the membranes or lying free in the cytoplasm. And uh, inside the cytoplasm and attached with the rough endoplasmic reticulum and their function is protein senses. So they are used for protein senses. Next is a cell wall. A tough non-living layer made up of cellulose surrounding the cell membrane. It is around the outside of the plant cells and the function of cell wall is prevents plant cells from bursting, allows water and uh, salts to pass through freely permeable. So this is a freely permeable membrane. You can say fully permeable membrane or sometime is written uh, permeable. So it means fully permeable. Next is the vacuole, a fluid filled substance around, uh, surrounded by a membrane inside the cytoplasm of plant cells and contains salts and sugars, helps to keep the plant cells firm. Uh, the membrane of the plant vacuole is called as tonoplast. Next is the chloroplast, an organelle containing chlorophyll inside the cytoplasm of the of some plant cells 
and it traps light energy for the photosynthesis next my dear students are the bacterial cell organelles which are cytoplasm cell membrane circular dna plasmids ribosomes and cell wall so let's discuss one by one cytoplasm a jelly like contains particles and organelles surrounded by the cell membrane contains cell structure for example ribosomes circular dna and plasmids uh cell membrane it's partially permeable layer that surrounds the cytoplasm around the cytoplasm and prevents cell contents from escaping controls what substances enter and leave the cell next circular dna a single circular chromosome inside the cytoplasm it controls cell division controls cell development and controls the cell activities plasmids small circular pieces of dna inside the cytoplasm contains genes that carry genetic information to help the process of uh, survival and reproduction of the bacterium ribosomes small circular structures inside the cytoplasm protein senses is their function cell wall a tough non living layer uh, not made up of cellulose but made up of peptidoglycans that surrounds the cell membrane this is around the outside of the bacterial cell and it prevents the cell from bursting allows water and salts to pass through the uh, through it this is also fully permeable membrane okay dear students uh next are